YouTube, this your boy down low back for another reply. But before then, let's talk about something that's going on in the music industry, man. So Immortal Technique got arrested for being affiliated with people who robbed and assaulted some people that was bootlegging shit, in which they were bootlegging his own shit, in which it kind of makes me wonder, you dig? Like, we live in a society where drug dealers, when they get robbed and shit, they can't go to the police and say, these people robbed me for my drugs and shit. They can't do that. But yet, bootleggers who be pretty much stealing all this shit, man, these people can go to the police and say that they robbed us for all of our shit that we was bootlegging off of them. Like, I thought illegal was illegal. But anyway, on to today's reply, and it's to that T-Pain, the Iron Way mixtape, in which I made a review not that long ago thinking that this was an album. That's my B. It came out as a mixtape. Now, overall, as I listen to this mixtape, man, it has its moments, man. Like, there's a good group of songs, like, right in the middle of this that are pretty damn dope and that pretty much show all of the range that he has as an artist. Like that need to be smoking with some mellow singing about some weed type shit self explanatory. Relax which shows his rap skills man because he can rap too. Heartbeat which is his song towards some women and shit in which that joint was fucking beautiful. And Represent which was some street shit with Yo Gotti on there man. Those four songs that happened like back to back to back to back those joints were damn dope. But the fucked up thing is this was a 20 track project. Those were the only four songs that were dope. I mean, there was a bunch of subpar and disappointing type joints like The King that had Bun B and Big Crit on it. I was thinking, oh shit, I like Bun B and Big Crit, man. Like, that could be one of my favorite tracks on here. Far from it. Overall, this is worth a listen and a download for individual tracks and such, man. Especially since it's a slow day in hip-hop today and shit. But it's really not that strong of a project, man. But anyway, on to today's article from DownloadPass.com. And today's article is about stacking up material for protection because this is a common mistake that I see in a lot of artists man see a lot of dudes out there is like okay I'm gonna make so much fucking music man and then when the time comes I'm gonna start releasing it all so nobody can steal my material and all of that bullshit like first of all if someone's gonna steal your shit they gonna steal the shit it doesn't matter if you dropping shit consistently or not dude second of all people that do this man they really get into the cycle of just making music and not doing shit with it and then you know shit can go wrong like a lot of people never fucking make it to the ending destination they lose focus and they end up wanting to do something else but for those people who do make it man sometimes they realize music completely fucking changed and what they did is no longer respectable in fucking hip hop it happens music changes like once every three years but yet the vast majority of the people man they never will admit it but they come to realize they never were fucking serious to begin with dude like the whole i'ma make all of this music shit that was just an excuse to continue making music without doing anything on the business end because nobody wants to do the business end shit understand this is why people make demos man so that you don't waste a huge amount of your life trying to do something that could not be successful you dig like you could record all of these fucking songs and then end up not doing any people not feeling it it doesn't sell but then you ended up wasting 10 years of your life building some shit that no one fucking wanted so you do demos and such to see what people gonna take to then you take it and you push that shit i hope you enjoyed the show you can follow me at twitter up there and you can go to downloadpads.com that's down there to read today's article